Welcome back. I'm back. Are you back? You better be back. If you're not back, you know what's gonna happen to you. I've warned you. This is your first time watching, I suppose you can't be back, but welcome. You're the only ones allowed not to be back. Anyways, we're in Madrill. Collect town information. What should we do? Should we evacuate this town too? But I'm sure that... Hey, what's going on? What boy? Where did you come from? To know. So you had to come here from so far away. It's like a five minute walk. In the countryside. Oh, well. Thanks, woman. Or, I'm sorry, guy with frowny face. Got big trouble in town. Go back home. Shut up, old man. Listen, boy, we have an evil king in this town. There's no telling what will happen. The map of evil kings was real after all. Ah, yes, I'm supposed to be checking that. What's that shadow? Oh, hey, you that circus boy. That magic trick, right? Uh, you're imagining this entire day. Hey, old man, how dare you treat me like a magic trick every chance you get? Oh, whatever. At any rate, it's much too dangerous right now. Children, stay inside. Do I have to talk to all of them? I can't remember. What's happening? I can't believe you're an evil king in Madrill. And weird old woman. Where's that evil king you're talking about? Answer me, I'll gobble you whole. What strange shadow? Uh, a handful. But um, I don't know. I just don't understand young people's sense of humor. If you want to know anything about the evil king, go to the town hall over there. Everyone there is talking. Cool. Town hall, you say? What up? No, we don't handle evil king matters. The heroes have ju ju jurisdiction over them. Let the heroes club handle it. I think we'll go home early today. Aren't you the mayor? Oh, he's the town manager. Silly me. It's really annoying one day posters coming up all over town. Evil King or not, that was really not a nice thing to do. Came down is such hard work. I worked overtime, man. Should take them all down, though. I think the only poster left is that one over there. Mad Rill. I am the sewer evil king. I plan to conquer the world. I am doing evil things in Madrill's underground sewer. Currently wanted evil monsters, young people with cool haircuts come apply. Evil monsters. Maybe I should apply. Maybe I should apply. I'm not a young person with a cool haircut. But I am an evil monster. Uh, I believe the person we're absolutely 100% required to talk to is uh, Mr. Know-It-All. Hanging out in the sleazy dive bar. Everyone knows I'm Mr. Know-It-All. What would you like to know, my son? Evil King calls himself Sewer. Evil King apparently lives in the town's underground sewer. Maybe there have been posters hung up all over town about some plan to conquer the world. I call myself Mr. Nodal, yet I had no clue an Evil King lived in the sewers. I'm ashamed. How about this other one? Don't worry, I'm sure the heroes will be. If you want to know about the heroes, go to the Heroes Club in the town hall behind Nell. Well, armed with this information, we should make haste. I believe talking to him triggers getting into the Heroes Club. Ah, yes, it triggers this. What do you mean I was too late? Do you know how far I had to travel to get here? Bail at me in a house. Don't get mad at me, we're not accepting any more hero applications. No use going in now. Never mind, let me in. Yes, ma'am. But wait, your parasol. Well, there she goes. Now then, watch this skillful debate as I get past the guard. This is the Heroes Club. You want to ask the hero something, boy? Usually I would just let you in, but it's crazy in there with everyone preparing to go on a Sewer King Punishment Expedition. I don't really understand why, but I sense I'll find dreadful hero Hopkins right in there. What's that shadow? Besides, Hopkins is the name of the great hero from 300 years ago. I don't know what you're thinking, but that person's been dead for a long, long time now. What? So who's the hero today? Well, it's hard to say who. There are more than a dozen heroes in Madrill alone right now. What? You fool, there can only be one hero. It's just the way it is, isn't it? In lesser games. Oh, whatever, I don't really care. Here, I'll let you in so you can check it out yourself. Sorry, didn't mean to talk to you. Look at all these heroes. These guys always make me laugh. But that's only three ranks difference. Whoops. What's your hero ranking? I'm 164th, eh? 164th, eh? I'm 161st. I win. Guy's an asshole. I wonder what kind of evil king he is. 
I think if he is an evil king, he'd be covered in dark, shiny, coarse hair and have twisted horns. He'd have thick white tail and a slimy body surface. He'd growl in a low, deep voice. I think I just changed my mind. Royal Braveheart Salon. What's your deal, champ? So, from the general public, anything you'd like to know? It's a hero ranking. It's a rating system in which all the heroes are ranked against each other to decide who is the best hero. The ultimate aim is to determine the great hero. We'll fight against the great evil king that's said to come again someday. Wasn't that spiffy? It's like I said, I'll make an exception and give you a number, but you still have to wait for your turn. That will do! How many times do I have to tell you to get to understand? Let me pass through the management office now. Bureaucracy be damned. Let me just say this, you should be grateful I'm giving you a number at all. And besides, you shouldn't have an umbrella open indoors. You're a hero, you should know better. Well, it's because... Of course I understand why it bothers you so much. Everyone knows your shadow is... Hey, ow! Fucking 360 no scope to this guy. Ouch, that hurt. That wasn't nice. Whatever. Well, there are all sorts of heroes, you know. Oh, that woman, I believe her name is Rosalind. I heard she's really good. Very, very good. Some would say the greatest ever. But you know she's got you know what. Ha ha ha. Oh, why don't you ask yourself why she uses a parasol? Careful you don't let her hit you. I dare say it's time to explore. I won't have it. He's just some phony called the Sewer Evil King. Why is it he's the only one the heroes are after when the true Evil King is right here? What an insult. You want heroes to go after you? Hmph. But of course, I'll apply my backhand to those second-rate heroes in a flash. Anyways, it is moi who will defeat the so-called Sewer Evil King. I will show those lamer heroes who the true Evil King is. Slave, go and begin your search. Yeah, yeah. This guy, I swear. Can't get a moment's rest with him around. All right. You there, bossy kid. Whiskamole team spy. It's not fair for you to act so big just because you have a curious shadow. I know everything about this town, but I won't tell you anything. Oh, okay. Hmm. I will never tell you that there is a back way that goes through the east side of town that only we know about. I won't tell you even if you torture me that Toby watches the secret entrance. Uh, thanks. Oops. But I'll never tell you as long as I live that my name is Dill. And if we talk to him again, he's Blabber Dill. Darn, I'll never say again. And then he repeats it. I like the, uh, like the joke of making him blabberdill as a result. Which one is it? I can't remember. Is it this one? No. So what the hell is in here? Now that I'm thinking about it. It is not good. Certainly traditional in Madrid. Folks are on the first level. Rich folks on the first level. Oh, whatever. Poor folks on the first level, rich folks on the second level. Never gotten along. That's no reason why the children should split into factions and fight. Dill, Dill, where have you gone? What's wrong with my child? I wonder how long he'll keep tagging along with Maggie. It's Dill's parents. I think it was beneath the steel sky? Where the poor people actually lived up in the higher floors and the rich people lived on the bottom. The story being air pollution sort of made the skies awful. How is your name? Do you want to pass? Well, you can say what you like. The password. Viva Whiskermol team! But, uh, because he hates us for being Whiskermol spies, we obviously go for the Spotted Cat team. Ah, Spotted Cat team. They're great. Maggie's so pretty, you know? Go on, you can pass. Oh, Toby. You're a terrible guard. Truly the worst. Later! <laughs> what the hell? Who left this rubble here? We'll never get past. What's your deal? Who to a current sewer of King Punishment? No one from the general public is allowed beyond this point. The point I'm beyond? Man, that felt good. I've always wanted to boss people around like that. And then there's this house, which has always been a mystery to me. But let's check it out. I'm Sewer King. One day I will conquer the world. But for now, this house in Madrid will do. And would you like to join me? For details, call 1555-I-AM-EVIL. I've tried it. It doesn't work. Oh, I think, uh... The elevator also has something written on it, but we'll check that out later. What up, Roslyn? What are you staring at? Go away. Uh, thank you for the other day. Huh, did we meet before on the streets? Sorry, I don't remember. What? What's wrong? What do you want from me? Uh, I've seen headbands, but yours. Uh, why do you carry a parasol? 
What? Why do I use a parasol? That's none of your darn business. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. I just lost my temper. Usually I don't get mad this easily. Yes, once I was a gentle, beautiful girl living a fabulous life as an elite hero at the Heroes University. She's not humble. Yes, my life was wonderful until that abominable incident. Girl in flashback. Since then, I've been looking for that guy who ruined my life. It's been a long and difficult journey. Can't blame me for losing my temper from time to time, I guess. I mean, I guess... Has nothing to do with it. Yeah, I can. I guess. Yes, yeah, so I finally searched him out. The Sewer Evil King must be the detestable enemy I've been looking for. How can I just sit and wait my turn? Of course, there must be a back route to the sewer somewhere in this town. Yes, there must be. Look for it, Rosalind. What am I waiting for? Let's get going! Ah, Rosalind. Poor girl. So close and yet so far. Ta-da! I'm now at the back entrance of town. And I believe that's the Gear Freak's house. Ah, oh, the shop's in there. Damn it, I want to check out the shop. Whatever. I do this bit and I'll get past that. What up, tough girl? Who are you? You can't enter without permission. You're engaging in a bloody battle. Leader, it's him! I didn't want to, but he forced me to reveal the secret backway info. Oh, he can do a trick with his shadow. It's totally hilarious. Hold your tongues, sewer rats! Mock the evil king's stand and you'll meet a speedy end. Wow, it's true, cool! I mean, uh, talk down to us again and I'll teach you a lesson. That's right, this is the boss of the... Calicos, Maggie. You can't scare us with your shadow. The hell is Calicos? I don't that up. Oh, Eater is a tomboy. We call her Maggie of the Cuts and Bruises. F you'd never call her that ever again. I know, you're a cat's paw of the whisker moles. Stop talking like this. And what's this gibberish? I agree. Calicos. Calicod? Calicos. Definition. Uh, I don't want Calico definition. I want Calico's definition. Yeah. Calico. Printed fabric. British. That's North American. A calico dress. Uh, I guess she could be wearing calico. And British. A type of cotton cloth, typically plain white or unbleached. Yes. Looks more uh, corduroy. I sort of always saw that as a turtleneck sweater, you know? I guess the skirt part. Or dress. I've never understood skirt versus dress. I think a dress is like sort of a onesie thing, but it can still, you know, come down to the knees. A skirt hat is just a bottom. I think that's it. But then again, I'm an idiot, so what do I know? Whatever, slave, let's go. We have important things to do. I don't have time to play hopscotch with these children. These brats wouldn't know their way around the sewer anyways. The back way to the sewer? We... You bet we know about it, it's, but it's back way just for us. You're in her fucking head bobbing. I'm not gonna tell you, you're a sneaky spy from the whisker moles. Enough lip stripling! <laughs> what is this whisker something or other? I'm the evil king Stan. Don't play the fool. Well, well, Namby Pamby boy. I need to start calling people Namby Pamby. Foul, you're a Namby Pamby boy. Having an internal dispute, that's typical of the Calicos, low-class kitties. Still don't get it. It's just a type of fabric. Robert! Fun fact about Robert. He was originally the character model for Ari. Note the sideways belt and the striped shirt and the hair that's shockingly similar. However, they decided to go for, in my opinion, a better character model with, um... You know, pants. And, uh... As a result... Robert's character model was simply left over and used here. Oh, Raggedy Maggie looking raggedy and maggedy as always, hmm. See, sideways belt, vest going on, similar-ish hair. They decided to give Ari a band-aid and the fingerless gloves, however, as well as belt and some shoes, or pants and some shoes. This building is our territory. The goodies of the Whisker Mole should just fawn over the mammy upstairs. I guess Robert has the fingerless gloves as well. Now. Oh, callous calicos use such catty words. 
It's a fat one, whatever. Besides, you're wrong about one thing. The back of this building is already under control of the Whisker Moles. What? When? You pretend to be goody-goody, but you do crappy things. It's sad the only thing an underdog can do is buck. We own this building. No, uh we already own the back of the building. Ooh. And we can enter from anywhere in such a rotten building. By the way, I've got something you might want to see. Is this your cat, isn't it? Oh no, Dilbert! Give my Dilbert back to me. It's unfair to take a cat as hostage. It's true. I've checked with Noki. It is forbidden. Oh, you are rude. I just gave shelter to an stray cat. Come to the back room of the building and I can give him back to you. You can get to the room, that is. Wahahaha. Hey, new member of Whisker Moles. Come out and say hello to the Calicos. Yeah, yeah. Do you give up? Just submit and give up. Yeah, give up. Yeah, give up. Cowards, you Whisker Mole leader. What should we do? I won't give up. I have a new member, too. Right? Where? Ha! What a shaky member. Ha 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 ha! See you in the back room. Ha ha ha. Being scanned at sewers is so pathetic. Poor Rosalind. Crabby Robert will prepare a sleazy trap. Will he now? A sleazy trap. There will be whores everywhere. <laughs> Counting on your new member. I can't stand it. Don't be absurd. If you can get my cat back, I'll tell you about the back way into the sewer. Stupid bouncy Maggie. Anyways, ready for the easiest puzzle in the history of this game, and any game ever. Why do I have to push such heavy boxes? Oh, I'm shedding tears. Hurry up, you slow bastard. Whoa, this is Robert's favorite boxes you can push but can't pull. Exit is blocked by boxes you can push but can't pull. Think hard about the order you need to push them in to clear the exit. You have to think hard. Looks hard. Go for it, new member. So, naturally what you need to do is push the ones on the side, but, you know, push that one forward, that one forward, and then that one to the side. I'm going to go ahead and stand right in the middle here and press X. I am now not touching the controller. Feel pathetic. What does a noble like me have to be involved in a child's fight? Slave, this is all your fault. You slow, 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 slave. Still not touching anything. Really does seem like they built that up to be a puzzle, but... I don't know. Just cutscene was better? Eh. Cheaper, maybe? I don't know. Robert! Well, I didn't think you'd break my trap that fast. Also, that's like the only way out of here, so... Yeah, he really could have just smoked us out. Anyways. Robert, you promised give Lilbert back to me. Hmm, no way I told you I can, but I didn't say I will. It's not fair. Not fair, not fair, Robert. Why are you so mean to me, stupid Robert? Crying won't help. What? Smack! You should be lucky. You didn't get, you know, spun around. What did you do that for, new member? Just cut it out. I don't care if you fight. At least have an adult involved. I didn't read what that said properly, but it was the worst excuse. Making a girl cry is the worst, too. Do you understand? Answer me. It's Maggie's fault. Maggie was... Damn it, I hate you, Maggie. I hate, 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 hate you. Boy of little note. Mm, what should I do? Re-retreating. Oh. Oh, later. Hey, new member. Wait, thank you for helping. Uh, you can enter sewers through the manhole. Leave the gate open so you can exit any time. Wait, you over there. What? You aren't going to the sewers, are you? An evil king is in there. That's why I'm going. Gee, what are you talking about? You're still a kid. Once you're dead, it's too late. Don't go. Ah, go away. Stop being nosy and mind your premature wrinkles. Whose voice was that? Uh, uh, mm, uh don't be sorry to be rude, miss. You have a ventriloquist? Whatever, you're really rude, though. Anyways, are you really going? That's right, Cho. Go away and leave me be. I can't let you, but I guess I, you have a reason, yes? Well, I have to enter into the sewer anyway. Just go down with you. Uh, yes, please. Wait, save, I didn't approve of this. Run, just run away, lose her. Uh, no, thank you, I'm fine by myself. Are you okay? Are you sick or something? I'm really worried. It's a good thing I'll be around to keep an eye on you. My name's Rosalind. Oh, Ari, nice to meet you, Ari. I think I still have to prepare, so I'll wait for you. Yeah, I need to buy some equipment and uh, save my game. Because you sometimes lose at this boss fight, and it's kind of a bitch. Also, apparently death hasn't stopped some of the speedruns of this. So, that's a bold strategy to have. Anyways, I believe, yeah, everything's clear now. To the shops. And yes, I am planning a speedrun in 2019. I look forward to that. That's your sort of thing. So that guy's... The weapon merchant shows up after we leave. 
Uh, this kid. Oh, hey, sweet, a fruit knife. Curve of the crest, that's the work of famous dude. I'll pay you 300 for it. Nah, fuck you. Oh, that's too bad. Come again. Change your mind? Fine, I'll splurge and make it 400. Yeah, sure. Great, here's money. Yay, bargaining. Come again sometime if you're interested. Talk to this guy. Don't you have, like, a nameless sword? Nope. Uh, energy flower is always useful. And, in fact, I need one for an achievement. Uh, ooh, clean outfit. And ordinary sword. Well, these are better. So I think I will equip these, actually. And how many nuts do I have? I just have the one? Well, fuck that. Make it a good solid 11. And equip... How much is that in terms of attack? That's much better for attack. Take or leave the clean outfit, really. 